Yeah, it's Friday, May 15, 2020. The time right now is 4.52. I'm heading into work. This got passed by a car. This guy must have been doing 70 miles an hour. He was tailgating me. I should have had a bumper sticker on my car saying uh, six feet. You know, just like everybody's supposed to stay six feet away, which really they don't. I just don't get it. You know, I mean, when you breathe or if you smoke or cough, you know, that shit lingers in the air for fucking eight seconds. But anyway, uh, my one buddy, he would have been 54 today. Uh, he died back in 2012. And uh, couldn't get a hold of him on Facebook because uh, well, he already passed away. I didn't get on Facebook until 2019. And I said I'd never fucking do it because I don't need anything. You know, I mean, that, that's addictive. You know, I mean, I just wonder who in the fuck is controlling people's lives nowadays. Is it Facebook, or are they controlling their own life? You know, yeah, the shit's funny on there, but, man, it is addictive. You know, it's like... I mean, when I, I, when I get off of there, I'm getting off there for good. I mean, and I keep saying I'm going to deactivate my account, because, yeah, it is addictive. When you're putting your priorities on Facebook before you're doing your stuff at your house, then there's a problem. And a lot of people do that. You know, I mean, I'm not looking to be popular. Fuck no. Fuck all that shit. I'm old. I don't need to be popular. I already got one foot in the grave right now as it is, but when people send stuff like with jokes, now that shit's funny. You have to laugh. You have to live, love, and laugh. That's what I go by. You know, and unfriendly people, you know, like my neighbors and stuff, I really don't fuck with them, you know, I don't even, I don't even really speak to them anymore, because they think you're supposed to speak to them first, fuck no, I ain't playing that dumbass bullshit, you know, especially my one neighbor, he gets out of his car and he's fucking singing, uh, I don't know what the fuck it was, it was a Donna Summer song, and I'm like, what in the fuck is he singing, he sounds like a dog, you know, like, my dog would have been howling if she would have heard him. But anyway, that's all I have to say is just be nice 365 days a year. Keep everybody in your heart. And like I said, this shit's going to get a lot worse before it gets better. They're just opening shit up way too soon. And them casinos, man, I'll tell you, they ain't catching my old white ass on them motherfuckers. I'll put it to you that way. You know, you might get a bunch of, you know, like old ladies and shit coming from church. You know, blessing the machine with their cross again. Mm -mm, I ain't sitting down uh, in that seat because uh, that old lady's probably got the shit. Them are the ones that they always bitch if you if you curse and you say God's name, you know, like God damn, you know, and they'll be like, son, watch your mouth. You know, and it's like, well, Jesus Christ, lady, what the fuck do you want me to say? You know, <laughs> that's just it. You know, it's like mine. I remember telling an old lady that one time. That was funny. I told her, I said, well, why don't you mind your business? You know, I'm not, I'm not fucking bothering you. I'm playing my slot machine. You're playing your slot machine. I just said, God damn. That's all I said. Don't use God, the, God's name in vain. You know, I really could have told her, why don't you go fuck yourself, you old pie face bitch. But I didn't. But anyway, that's all I got to say.